Is truth an optional luxury in the realm of politics, or should it be a mandatory requirement? This question has sparked many a debate, with opinions as diverse as the people who voice them. Today, we delve into this intriguing topic, exploring both sides of the argument. On one side, proponents of mandatory truth-telling argue that it's the foundation of a healthy democracy. They believe that politicians and public officials are servants of the public, elected to represent their constituents' interests. For the public to make informed decisions about who should represent them, they need accurate and reliable information. Therefore, these advocates argue, politicians and public officials should always tell the truth, and lying should be punishable by law. This perspective holds that truth-telling promotes accountability and trust. If public officials know they can be held accountable for their words, they'll be less likely to make false promises or mislead the public. Trust, they argue, is the bedrock of any society, and mandatory truth-telling can help to rebuild faith in our institutions. However, there's another side to this coin. Those against mandatory truth-telling argue that while honesty in public office is certainly desirable, enforcing it is impractical and perhaps even dangerous. They contend that politics, by its very nature, involves negotiation and compromise. Sometimes these processes require a degree of secrecy or strategic misdirection. If every word a politician says is scrutinized for absolute truth, the art of politics could become paralyzed. In addition, critics warn of the potential for misuse. Who would determine what constitutes the truth? Could this requirement be used as a tool for political persecution? with those in power defining truth to suit their own agendas? These are serious considerations that cannot be ignored. This debate is far from settled, and both sides present compelling arguments. Supporters of mandatory truth-telling argue that it promotes accountability, trust, and informed decision-making, all vital components of a healthy democracy. On the other hand, critics raise valid concerns about the practicality of enforcing such a rule and the potential for misuse. To summarize, the question of whether truth should be a mandatory requirement in politics is a complex one. It involves balancing the need for honesty and transparency with the realities of political strategy and the dangers of potential misuse. As we continue to grapple with this issue, one thing remains clear. The importance of truth in politics cannot be overstated. So, while the debate rages on, Perhaps we should each ask ourselves, what do we value more, absolute truth or strategic pragmatism? And how do we balance these values in the complex world of politics? As we ponder these questions, let's remember that the pursuit of truth, however defined, remains a cornerstone of any healthy democracy. And with that thought, we conclude our exploration of this topic. It's a conversation that is sure to continue and one that is vital to the health of our democratic societies. After all, in the realm of politics, the truth is more than just a word. It's a guiding principle that shapes our decisions, our actions, and ultimately, our world.